this is Carl's and welcome back to my channel. Today is Vlogmas Day 2. I decided to get this cute little Christmassy palette out. It is the Too Faced Enchanted Forest. And let's use it in the spirit of the holiday season. This is what it looks like. Um, it's going to be my first time using the mascara as well. My lips are done. And I did use the lip gloss that comes in here. And I don't know if... It's minty. I don't know if it's supposed to... Oh, it says lip injection. I don't know. But my lips are tingly. And not gonna lie, my top lip feels a little bit fat. Let's go ahead and finish getting ready and carry on with our day. So I brought out my little brushes. And I'm only using two, three, I think. Let's see. Flat shader brush blending brushes how cute is the packaging first let's talk about that uh very cute it has like you can't see it really but it has like little specks of glitter and it's just so cute um very i don't know when i saw it i thought of easter rather than christmas this is what the palette actually looks like um cute uh this is what it looks like and when you open it this is what you see and like I said, I'm just trying to get presentable for the day. So let's see what look we come up with. Like if you know me, you already know that I gravitate towards light browns. I like nudes, a little bit of burnt orange, nothing too fancy. So just for today, I guess, you know what? Let's start with Christmas cookie right here. I'm gonna use that on the crease. Look at me trying to be a beauty guru. Like, what? When I started using makeup, I was 18. I was in college and I started off by defining my eyebrows. Like, I, I started penciling in my eyebrows. And I feel like for the most part, there's nothing that I regret as far as the eyebrows go that I ever feel like Oh, like I shouldn't have uh, done that. I had sharpie brows. I never had sharpie brows. Okay, and that's something I'm proud of. Eyeshadow is a new thing for me, and you know I'm not really great at doing eyeshadow, but I love eyeshadow palettes. It's like I love them. I love, like you can never have enough, like nuded, nuded. I don't even think that's a word. You can never have enough eyeshadow palettes. That's what I'm trying to say. But um, I mean. I suppose she's blended. I, I know that you're supposed to go a little bit darker on the edge. Let's do Mrs. Claus right here. Wish me luck, cause that color is too dark for my taste. But we can do it. Um, yeah, she done messed up. I heard that if you use a harsh line trying to blend things out, it won't blend. But if you use a light hand, it'll blend. Um, what is this? Like, what is that dot? Oh my lord. You see that big? Ugh. She said, Curly, you will stay. This is a completed makeup look. I mean, oh, uh, I don't know. I, this is why I don't mess with dark colors on the edge. I feel like I tend to, mess, like, what? Like, what is that right there? Oh my god. Okay, well, from afar. This is presentable. And you know what? It is what it is. I work from home. Nobody's going to see it. haven't done so yet make sure you get caught up with my vlogs and go watch vlogmas day one this should be up by the time you're seeing this vlogmas day two currently it is 2 42 i'm still working i have a meeting later this afternoon and i don't know i was thinking what to film later just because like i'm telling myself that we're gonna do vlogmas here but i haven't really 
created any structure so we're just gonna wing it um there's one thing that i want to show you guys um my husband and i we made a december christmasy list of things that we want to do we have it on the fridge so because it's on the fridge that's how you know it's official so this is the list that we have and yes it's kind of funny but let's read them uh one set up the christmas tree and decorate the house go watch christmas lights like take a drive and watch christmas lights build a gingerbread <laughs> home bake christmas cook cookies take holiday photos listen to christmas music which we've been doing have a game night ice skating if possible but this one's going off the list i don't feel safe being out in public so i'm staying home <laughs> do something nice uh kind of like i've gone to skid row before with my church to feed you know the homeless population and it's such a beautiful feeling um so yeah that's something that we have on the list uh sip hot coffee by the fire <laughs> <laughs> uh, kiss them there's a mistletoe which I should cross this out advent calendar which we've started but we got to finish it so I'm gonna cross it out until complete wear an ugly Christmas sweater and my definition of ugly is not really ugly it's more like a cute ugly go to the snow I mean I don't know <laughs> and then movies to watch I want to watch the Grinch Christmas Cupid holiday in handcuffs home alone Santa and I don't know if this is a Christmas movie I've never seen the nightmare before Christmas it sounds more like a Halloween movie but my husband requested that we add that to the movies to watch and then I want to go I want to get like Christmassy nails and then of course this one's the funny one let the husband play with the boys on Call of Duty. <laughs> uh, we need to... Actually, I can cross this one off already. I, My husband and I have swapped Christmas lists. And my husband also wanted to add... Uh, does it say... Oh, it says... Uh, one entire lazy day of just laying around. Hey guys, quick update. So currently it is 5.18 p.m. and I've decided to call it a day as far as work goes. And I'm gonna have a little bit of time to unwind, have dinner, and tackle my homework. I have finals coming up and major projects due. I have a presentation coming up. So it's just a lot happening. And I also have to turn on the Christmas tree. So let's do that. I don't know why, but just turning on the tree is like a mood changer. It's a vibe. Like it just, I don't know, it just makes you feel like happy and cozy inside. And oh, I love it. So yes, our tree is lit. If you are a Costco member and you love a popcorn, I am definitely recommending some zebra popcorn. It is pretty good. I recommend. Okay, this might be like an old soul, old person type of thing, but this with some cafecito okay like some hot coffee mm -mm -mm. you guys know how eggnog is such a holiday thing like such a holiday christmasy thing okay well all i know is that i've never had eggnog i don't know what it tastes like but you know in the december holiday feels i told my husband that i wanted to try eggnog so he got eggnog and I tried it yesterday for the very first time. Unpopular opinion? I did not like it. <laughs> well, isn't this a familiar background? So I am approaching finals at school and quickly, I just want to come in here and integrate this to this Vlogmas. And I want to discuss or talk about the ipad pro which is what i'm currently using and relying heavily on to get through grad school so this was my birthday gift last december i started grad school in january so this is a 2019 ipad pro model and i just want to quickly give a review and my review is that i love it the end no i'm just kidding so first let's acknowledge how cute this cover is like if you look at it you would actually think that it's a legitimate composition notebook but no no it's not it's actually a smart case and once you open it it turns on turns off turns on turns off i ended up purchasing a pencil cover because i have a pencil so i want to say that this ipad makes my life so much easier i honestly don't remember 
how I got through undergrad if I'm honest which was I'm not gonna say the year no I'm gonna say the year it was in 2015 when I got through undergrad and graduated um honestly this is where it's at all of my PDFs this is everything my this is my computer in a notebook which is magical disclaimer i do want to say that my ipad is not for personal reasons or like youtube shopping anything fun related activities no this ipad is just for school so the apps in here are not that like oh my gosh exciting so quickly i guess i will share what i currently have if you guys if you guys are interested so this is page one as you can see everything is generic la 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 page two la 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 and i only have two pages and this is what i use the most i go in by, with files and use things that are on my desktop and then i go in to good notes and this is where i annotate my notes i do everything this is what some of my notes look like and this device just makes life so much easier. You have everything, everything in one sitting. Different color pens, this thing has it. Highlighters, this thing has it. Reading, PDFs, everything and anything. You wanna type up a document, you gotta do a presentation. Honestly, if you guys are contemplating and in investing in an iPad if you're in school, I would definitely, definitely recommend. I feel that it has made my studying very easy i am able to gravitate and go back and forth with documents annotating notes is a game changer and if you i am a very notes type of person i need physical notes so anything that you have in here in your ipad you can definitely uh print it out like i said if you are contemplating and investing money in an ipad because you need to get through school definitely do it you won't regret it and this is an, an in-depth review it is just how I feel and if you guys have an iPad and you use it leave your comments down below and say how much you guys love it by the way I forgot to say I ended up getting the cover at Amazon my dinner panda chow mein and orange chicken All right, so I'm gonna open up my fortune cookie. Let's see what I get. All right, crispy cookie. It says, in due time, you will be financially comfortable. <laughs> in due time, you will be financially comfortable. Hmm. You caught that, cameraman? Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> open mine. You want me to open yours? Yes. You don't want to do it? No, you open it. Alright. So this is the husband's cookie. Let's see what it says for him. I don't know if that's how it works. I think you should open it, but I like cracking it, so uh, cool. for you it says you are a leader. I'll repeat that. You are a leader. You caught that cameraman? You caught that cameraman? 